Irene was at school when she was shot. I couldn't accept it. She got hurt and uh, you're never gonna see her ever again. During the peaceful march of 16 June 1976, police responded by suddenly opening fire on gathered school children. 16-year-old Irene Palatze was one of many learners who lost their lives during the course of the 1976 uprising. Today we honor her life by learning about her and what happened to her through the person who knew her best, her younger brother Ronald, who we are privileged to have here today. The student we will be honoring today at Krugerstorpar is Noble Vabasco. When recounting the events that led to Noble's death, Leonard said that they began like any other, only to take a sudden and tragic turn. The gun that shot him, a 10-year-old boy with an R5, that was, <laughs> you know, Holy Family College has decided to partner with Nedbank and Youth X and adopt and honor a student into Holy Family. His name is Kerabo Monoy. I see my son's name on the honors board. He's right there in the wall to be seen by everybody. I'm pleased, I'm happy. Telling these type of stories, I think is fundamentally important in making people feel acknowledged. If kids in 1976 could fight against a police state being shot at, most of them dying, a lot of them dying. If kids then could do that, what's stopping me now being able to achieve what I can?